March 5, Tuesday of the 8th week in Ordinary Time A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Mark Peter began to say to Jesus, We have given up everything and followed you. Jesus said, Amen, I say to you. There is no one who has given up house or brothers or sisters or mother or father or children or lands for my sake and for the sake of the gospel who will not receive a hundred times more now in this present age. Houses and brothers and sisters and mothers and children and lands with persecutions and eternal life in the age to come. But many that are first will be last, and the last will be first. The Gospel of the Lord Receive a hundred times more. Some young people who hear the call to the priesthood or religious life hesitate to make the leap, thinking that leaving their families and friends behind would mean a big loss. Some parents, too, object to their sons or daughters entering the seminary or convent for fear of losing them. The truth, however, is by letting go of their children, they gain more families and friends in the process. Just as those who have sons or daughters in religious life or priesthood. Of course, on the part of the person making the journey, there is an apparent loss of opportunity to have or enjoy certain things. But those of us who have embraced this kind of life, Testify to the rewards that following Jesus closer offers. This is true of any type of following Jesus closely, offering our time and talents in our parish. We lose or waste time, even money, but we experience immeasurable joy in serving and being able to help others. In fact, being close to Jesus every day in service is reward in itself. Are you afraid of following Jesus for fear of losing things or people you love? Why don't you try and discover the contrary?